as you go along, you realize that there's so many people that are involved in your project, and it's not just one person making this happen, it's so many people, and I'm grateful to all those folks that have made this project and our Atrium Cafe something to be really proud of. Being asked by Neil, my VP, to work on the Atrium project was one of the highlights of my career because I had never done a ground up project before. I had renovated our kitchen and changed our model from a traditional service to room service. I've done many renovation projects, but I had never done anything from the ground up. To me, it was so essential to be able to reach out to my local chapter members and go visit their facilities. Without their help, um, I don't know where I would have gotten some of the ideas that I got. They were very open with me attending their facilities, taking pictures, looking at their menus, trying to look for ideas on what exactly was going to be our concept here at the Atrium Cafe. Because we are in a wellness center, it was really important to keep things healthy. Um, we wanted to have that vision uh, that our menu was not going to have fried foods, no soda. We tried to keep things simple with panini grills and uh, induction cooking. And we have smoothies, which are our biggest seller. I was able to hire my manager during the building of the cafe. So he was hired as a cook at our hospital and that was only the beginning of his journey. We did hire him as a succession plan of knowing he was gonna be our manager. And with that, it really, really helped because he was able to help me build the recipes, test the recipes. We worked with our PR department to uh, create these reward cards, and those were great. I appreciate my leadership, um, Neil and Bob, being able to give me this project and sticking with the softball model.